So anybody who knows me knows I love Clinique, especially their facial products. And since I was running low on their liquid soap that I use for my face, this is it. Uh, it's just pretty basic. Uh, I decided to order their Acne Solutions Cleansing Foam. And I used to use this a long time ago, but I stopped because my face had cleared up. And as you can see, it's kind of like breaking back out again. And it's probably due to all the stress and things related to COVID. But anyway, so I ordered that and then I ordered this moisturizer and I don't know how many people are familiar with their Skin ID line, but what happens is they have a base uh, moisturizer and then they have a cartridge to target whatever area that you wanna target. Like this is their dramatically different moisturizing BB gel and it has like a sheer tint on it, but the cartridge that I chose, it was for I think like um, refining your pores and texture so it works pretty well not this is one of my favorite ones um and then um i have a lot of their moisturizers a lot of this stuff this is another one of my favorite ones this is their dramatically different oil control gel and i have a combination of skin so um my face tends to get oily but the gel moisturizer tends to balance all of that but anyway so they have a brand new product that um i haven't seen in stores it's their clinique id Dramatically different hydrating clearing jelly. Um, and it's supposed to have 24 hour hydration repair uh, plus anti imperfections. And it has um, salicylic acid in it. And salicylic acid is good for acne. And then the cartridge that I chose to go with it, um, this one is targeting imperfections. And I believe this probably has a bit of salicylic acid in it too. It's probably a lot. But um, they usually work pretty well. Again, it's brand new. Uh, I haven't tried this one before. So I'm gonna give it a try and we're gonna see what happens in about seven days. Um, so let's open her up. So once you unbox it, it actually looks like this and you just take the cartridge out, you just drop it in and screw it on in and make sure it's nice and tight. So I've already cleansed my face with the cleansing foam um, and I'm not gonna use a toner. Uh, probably should, but I'm not going to because I don't want my skin to dry out really bad. Um, but if you did, I have like a whole entire drawer worth of skin uh, facial stuff. Um, yes, I am addicted to it, but anyway. Their uh, toners are even numbered, um, and it's numbered based on your skin um, type. Um, so I like number four, and number four is usually oily, or the, it's usually an oily skin type, or I like number three, and three is usually a mix. So uh, I do use these, but I don't wanna use them tonight, um, cause I'm just starting this again tonight. Um, but anyway. So we're gonna pump it out and it has so one side is the actual gel and the other side is the actual cartridge uh, or whatever is in the cartridge. And so it looks sort of like this. And as you can see, uh, this one's pretty clear and translucent, but anyway. Uh, so we're gonna actually put it on, uh, put it all around. It's not really sticky, which is good. Um, so we're gonna see what happens after seven days um, and see if it kind of like helps with my acne here um, and see if it actually does what it's supposed to with the skin imperfections. Clinique stuff works really well anyway, so I usually see a difference in a few days anyhow, um, but we'll see. So I've been using it for a little over a week and you can actually see that it's decreased the size of my pimples quite a bit. Uh, usually they recommend about four weeks so you can see the full effects of everything, but it has uh, improved my skin texture just a little bit my pores don't look as large and it doesn't dry out my skin when it goes on and after it dries it, it doesn't leave like a sticky residue or anything like that and I usually get pretty oily during the daytime but it kind of kept all of the oil production under control so I wasn't like overly shiny or anything like that but I will actually check out the Skin ID. It's actually a very good product line. It's customizable to your need. Sometimes they may have a good deal and you may be able to find some coupons on like Retail Me Not or something like that. But anyway, give it a try. You might like it.